Last 3.57262 years. <laughs> <laughs> the best part of the day is the best part of this day is to attend the Toastmasters meeting and evaluate the speech. The evaluations can be difficult, but often the best approach is to address the overall content, watch carefully for the best use of the vocal variety, gestures, and confidence in the speech. Please welcome. Second speech in the Common Communicator Manual, organizer speech. And it was a great start, I should say your second speech, and your path towards speaking clairvoyance, <laughs> speaking perfection. Your objectives were to select an appropriate outline and make your message clear through supporting arguments or supporting facts for your speech. And your speech met all your criteria, very well organized. I was actually very impressed by the amount of organization that went into your speech because you, when you started talking about lead, you really broke it down for us into what it is for the employees. You started out talking about what the mission is, and you talked about how over time interest has dwindled in the new mission by which lead is now organized with strengthening connections to members, focusing on quality, hosting guest speakers, around Robin playing. You went through an incredible amount of detail. And then you also brought it back to the audience, how to get involved in, in this process. And you talked about the objectives, which were increasing attendance and, and management networking. And finally, you used the word, I want to summarize, which is a good way to say, I'm bringing the speech to a conclusion. And it really notifies everyone in the audience that you are, in fact, getting to your end point. I do have a few suggestions I think would be helpful in the future. One of the things I noticed were that during your speech, you did, in fact, uh, have a lot of eye contact. So you moved around the room quite well. But you, your eye point was a little high for the audience. You kind of kept it above everyone's head a little bit. And I think if you would just kind of focus on a person or two as you're speaking, it would, it would draw a little more interest into it. You were a little bit locked onto the lectern, unfortunately, in your speech. You were using notes, but I think that's okay as where you're, where you're at currently when you're speaking. And when you did use gestures, you were kind of like hanging just right on the, right on the edge of the lectern. You, you, would, you would say something, but your hand sort of never came off, and you didn't really sort of engage the audience in any way. So kind of focus on getting off the lectern a little bit, and use a little more vocal variety, and perhaps slow down just a little bit during certain points, key points in your speech, because I think you tended to keep a really rapid pace going. You ran a little bit long, but not over your time limit. But I think that was probably a driving force. And maybe when you rehearsed it, it may have been running a little bit long for you. So either cut out some of the content to get yourself down into the time frame you need to be, but try to keep your pace not so uniform and speedy as you go through the speed. Kind of slow it down a few places. And I think you're well on your way towards great speaking topics. You didn't stultify the audience at all. No. Okay, it was interesting. We appreciate that. Thank you very much.